Hi everyone, it's Valerie from Faithful Crafter back with another project and this is my latest mini album I just finished. It's titled God's Beautiful Promise from Psalms 121. I used the Gabrielle paper collection from Bow Bunny uh, throughout this whole album. I challenged myself to just stick with the one paper collection um, and use embellishments uh, throughout the book and that was sort of the main main design effort here. The color theme throughout this paper is a turquoise, turquoise and coral um, color theme. On the cover and throughout this book I used a lot of uh, little vintage jewelry pieces um, and this is a cross, a wood cross with gold tone running through the middle that you can actually take off and wear. Um, a gold tone pin and pearl and a, a grouping of mulberry paper flowers. If you didn't see my video already on the front and the back of this book I did the crackle paint technique and everything is rubbed in vintage photo distressing ink. The butterfly is glossy accented. Let's see if I can... it's nice and shiny and glossy. Uh, inside this book uh, the papers are phenomenal with the butterflies so I really didn't want to cover them up but I wanted to showcase the scripture so I did it on um, transparent paper. Uh, in this particular uh, verses it's the Song of God's Protection Day and Night from Psalms 121 1 through 8 um, and it's a beautiful beautiful um, testament to hope. Um, it says, I lift up my eyes to the hills where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip. He who watches over you will not slumber. Indeed, he who watches over Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. And the sun will not harm you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all harm. He will watch over your life. The Lord will watch over your coming and going both now and forever. What a great testament. Um, it's your assurance and hope. That's what it says. Uh, the scripture is framed in a green trim, and these are metal brads on each piece. This book has a pocket. This is a 6x6 six six album. Again, I used the, the paper collection as they had it, and just trimmed out heavy card stock and then bound it with the uh, ball chain and eyelets to secure them. The next page has a beautiful vintage lace that I have in my uh, collection on my Etsy store. Again, glossy accented little butterfly, pearls. Um, now these are some beautiful doily pieces I had that the coral color just matched the paper collection beautifully. Double trim here with um, ribbon and trim. Vintage buttons. This folds open and more journal areas. Just like that. Love this paper. The colors are amazing. Vintage, beautiful. Opens up. It's like a little jewel box. And here's an area for photo to tuck down in there. Vintage buttons, feather, and bow. I painted the frame in white and then hand stamped with French script the um, in a sepia brown tone. It's just beautiful paper and the way that uh, Bo Bunny did it, it just, it's amazing. It's hard to cover. It was too hard to really <laughs> want to mess with it too much. This is a beautiful uh, applique piece of lace that I included on this page and some beautiful mother of pearl uh, buttons. There's vintage buttons, plastic. Um, they were just just beautiful. I thought they added a nice tone on tone here. A lot of area here to put extra journaling and photos. Again, another pocket here. Uh, these are the pieces that Bow Bunny and the paper collection had. All my pages are front and back finished on all the sides. I have eyelet, ball and chain, more journal in the back. Everything's finished all the way around. This was a fun section I did. Um, I wanted to create sort of this pull-off... Let's see if I can do this here. This is what I call a desk wallet. This was a pretty piece here. Trimmed it out in some tatted white trim. 
And then what you do is you can open this up and the paper uh, I cut special so it just could sit on a desk. Um, it just sits. It's a trifold wallet piece that would be on a desk that you could put photos and any particular messaging in. It's all finished all the way around. Beautiful piece that's included in this album. Uh, some of my fabric flowers that I did. Stick gold stick pin butterfly. I, just the butterflies, as you can see, are just amazing. Again, pockets. I finished out all the front and back. More pockets. Butterflies everywhere. Crowns. Butterflies. <laughs> Lots of pockets. More area for photography. And these beautiful uh, mulberry paper roses I just thought were just lovely. The paper has the script, so I did a matching, again, a frame, white painted, edged in vintage photo, and then uh, stamped with the French script. Just like that. These feel like little jewelry boxes to me when you open them. And the back page, beautiful, beautiful papers here. And this has all the different turquoise, and these are photo frames you mount from the top, just like that. Beautiful paper, and the back's all finished as well. And this has the crackle paint on it as well. Well, I hope you enjoyed this album. Um, I had a lot of fun making it as an artist. I think we all struggle with, are we done with it yet? Um, you could, I think I could still be playing with this for a while. But um, anyways, I hope you enjoy it. It's going up on my Etsy store. Um, I hate to part with it. Uh, so much went into it. Um, but it's, I'm, I'm thinking it's going to go to a good home. So have a great day. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any comments, leave them. And by the way, when I get your comments, thank you so much. I try to answer them. I know I can't get to them all sometimes, but thank you so much for your wonderful comments. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.